Hello guys and welcome back, we're last left off. I am trying to take Claw Island. <laughs> and it's working. It's definitely working. I've optimized the game mechanics for so I can actually get in here. Just just a lot of bowmen now. Most of my army hasn't engaged. So if I was actually to turn up the difficulty at this point, or sorry, turn up the amount of people at this point, we could easily overwhelm them, I think. They are just bowmen, so even if I have levies, they're around about the same quality. Oh god, they took down one of my elites. It's like my last Dragonstone elite that I've got. Anyway, no more coming up. Come on! Come on! It all comes down to the fact that most of them, that was five damage. Oh my, if I didn't have the shield on my back, I would have been shot dead. I thought that was going to kill me. Okay, everyone back out. Follow me. Back off. Back down. Come down the stairs again. Get all these men in. Stabbed him in his leg. Got a Northman. Again, most of my men are levies. So there's not much can really do there. Or at least the majority of the men I'm throwing in the, at them at the moment are levies. All right, get the gateway's clear. Go. I got him. Go. You charge that. I'm not charging that. You're struggling. There's more. This is all. It's all the archers. That's all that's left, and they can kill me, especially Lombos. But if I can just get them into melee, we can stab them as much as we like. Thank God they no longer want to be on the walls. It's just fighting on the gate at the gatehouse. That one, that one guy in the back just been mobbed. Okay, we're almost there. I feel like we've almost won this. And somehow I survived with one HP. I say that now, someone's gonna stab me in the back, or shoot me with an arrow. A stray arrow's gonna hit me in the eye, or the head, or something. I'm waiting for it to happen. They're gonna spawn right on me. Because this is the spawn point. Oh my god, we did it! I am fully red! <laughs> right. It happened. We won! Okay, we are victorious! 14... Right. How many did it come down to? 13 are dead, 43 are wounded. I killed 140 men. Half the army was killed by me! One by Carver. I killed half the garrison! And I sa uh, saved Sir Adam Ma Marbrand? Who who was that for? Westlands! You're free to go. F well, you're welcome, good sir. Right. Yeah, I'm capturing as many men as I can. Christ. Okay. Levies. Vanguard. You are becoming a household guard. Oh, that looks great. Uh, yep. Yeah. Uh, we can have more of you, more of you. Uh, have a few halberds and the rest on men at arms. Need more men at arms, really. Halberds. We need some archers now. Need to have our elite halberd. Okay, you guys go up. All hedge knights survived. That that's great. I'm gonna need them, and you are definitely part of the black sword guard. Sure, the loot. Right, arm and sword. It's a good, decent, decent helmet, but not something I can use. My lord, we have taken Claw Island. What do you wish to do? I want to have Claw Island for myself. As you wish, my lord. Claw Island has fallen to your troops. 
and you are now and now a full control of the castle. Uh, you can plunder spoils of war worth 1,100 of coins. You can station troops here to defend it against enemies who may try to recapture it. Also, you can select uh, whether you will now hold the castle for yourself or give it to a faithful vassal. Uh, well, I, I'll split between my vassals, but I don't have any, so... Okay, you now possess land in your name and are not subject to another noble. This makes you a ruler in your own right. With your court temporarily located at uh, Claw Isle, however, uh, the other sovereigns will uh, fir at first consider you a threat. If any, uh, uh, for if any upstart warlord can claim the f uh, grab a throne, then their legitimacy is called into question. You may find it desirable at this time to pledge yourself to an existing kingdom if you want to continue as a sovereign ruler. No. Oh. Uh, if you want to continue as sovereign ruler, then your first priority should be to establish an independent right to rule. You can establish right to rule through several means. Marrying a highborn family, recruiting uh, new lords, governing your lands, treating other rulers, treating with other rulers, or dispatching your companions on missions. At any rate, your first step should be to appoint a chief minister from among your companions to handle affairs of state. Different companions have different capabilities. You may uh, appoint a new minister from time to time. You may uh, change your court by speaking to the minister. Right. Uh. Ooh. I need them all. I guess Fena. Fena is the least needed. Because I need you to gather my food. I need you for healing. I need you for engineering. I need you to carve. So, Fena. For now. I might have to recruit a companion specifically for this. Okay. The name. What will your name uh, what will the name of your sovereignty? What will be the name of your sovereignty? Uh, how about... We'll name it... Swordland. Swordland. We are the Swordland. Like, this is Stormlands. The Westlands, we are Swordland. Maybe the Swordland? We'll go with Swordland. I could call it something else like, uh, Black Swordtopia. Or whatever, um... But we're gonna go with the Swordland. There we go. I am the king! Any man who must say I am the king is no true king. You can have that guy, you can have that guy. I'm keeping all of you. Veteran archers, yeah, you can have that. Have my spears. You can have that. I pretty much have all of my men. Bar in a few. Hey, a longbow, definitely put you in there. Crossbow, yep, you can have that. Crackle Levy, Dragonstone Archers, pretty much take as many men as you can. Because you'll need it to hold against the armies that are going to be coming. Halberts, two archers, I'll throw them in there. I'll give you a decent amount of halberts. In fact, I'll give you all the halberts. You have that guy. Dragonstone Levy's right, let's get some more halberts and throw halberts in here. I'll keep the Dragonstone Levies, and I'll keep the Veterans, keep the Bravo, uh, you can have the Crossbowmen. Veterans, Dragonstone, Household Guard, Vanguard, right. I'll give you a Vanguard as well. And I'll also give you these prisoners. Okay, Managed Castle. Uh, recruit some troops. Okay, you can recruit troops. Uh, you can recruit troops of Swordland uh, for this castle. Recruiting troops cost 800 dinars, and you are required at least one day. You have zero dinars left here. Uh, you can recruit zero times. Uh... Okay, I, I've just spent a bit of money. That's fine. Uh... What was a prisoner tower? Uh, forget it. But what about a messenger post? Yeah, I might need that, so we'll go ahead with that. What is Sort Defenders? Okay, you be on the top. You be on the bottom. Essentially, I want all the archers up front. Yeah, definitely have all the archers appear first. That way we can just rain down hell upon them. Yeah, especially these crossbows. Have them. 
Okay. Lord's Hall. Fedda! At your service, my lord. May I offer a word of advice, my lord? It seems that your rights rule as an independent monarch is not sufficiently recognized. Uh, this may bring us problems further down the road. It is advisable that you find a kingdom who uh, you share interests with and seek recognition to establish yourself. Right. Uh... Okay. Our new staff member. Um, I want to appoint a Castilian. Eh, we'll eventually get one uh, just on his own, I think. My castle guard. Right, and my chest. This is what I want. This is all I want. Where's my chest? Open my chest. Right. Here's the hat. Uh, here's the books. Here's some tools. Here's the wildfire. And I'm done. Okay. Ah, as a newly... As a newly enthroned ruler of a sovereign realm, many men and women come to seek your favor. Goldsmiths, mass, uh, master armors, and all sorts of other craftsmen flock to your court. And you're uh, soon overwhelmed with the requests for work and lucrative contracts. For goldsmiths and armors, in particular, are persistent in their praise of your rule and how you should have a crown suitable for your noble head. I will require an expensive crown. As the goldsmiths and armors leave your court and return with uh, return to their work, you notice one man loitering in the corner. When everyone has left, he introduces himself as Rosello of Core, uh, a renowned armor. He offers to forge you a magnificent tournament helmet suitable for a champion such as yourself. Uh, ignore the armor. We're not spending that much money on that. Uh, at Sementor Rule, you decide to get the blessing of the gods. The coronation ceremony will be a grand affair. And announced to all the world, uh, announced to all the world your benevolence and rights rule. You decide to request a septum to, anoint, a septum to anoint you with holy oils. A red priest to perform a fiery ritual. Arrest a drowned priest to place a crown upon your head. Request one of your vassals to place a weirwood crown on your head. Of course, the drowned god. Plus two rights to rule. Uh, you can now shape the domestic policy of your sovereignty. Uh, do you want to change the policy? What's my domestic policy right now? Uh, oh my god, I've never... <sighs> High quality troops in exchange but increases army size. I want great quality. We'll have mediocre quality, I think. We'll just keep it as is. We're not gonna, we're not gonna do anything. There's bandits. Really? There's bandits. Wait here. Oh! <laughs> oh, why? Oh, Lord, why? <laughs> this may not last. I'm just throwing it out there. We have food, and we have a garrison. That they become- they became my citizens. Okay. Well, we'll wait for- They left. They left! <laughs> they left! <laughs> okay. Perfect. Thank God. That was close. Okay, we're gonna attack the bandits. This'll be great, because this'll actually make them like me. Okay. Got my hedge knights, I got my people, and I'll be able to upgrade my levies I have. I can recruit more levies from Dragonstone. Okay. Okay. God damn it. It's gonna be difficult from now on. It, like, this is hard mode now. Okay, my knights have just sort of gone on ahead and get just whacking them now. Just destroyed something. The horse is getting killed. The driver of my horse not get lamed. Well, he died anyway. Nope. I don't need this! I killed like half a garrison with this sword. 
Must be a legendary blade at this point. Who needs Valyrian steel when I have a bastard sword? I'll get the Valyrian steel sword and I'll get to Carver. You'll love it. Okay, my peasant's coming in. This just proves how good of a lord I am on level 25. I'm only at war with the Stormlands, and they are quite close. So I'm going to need to re-raise an army. I'm going to need to fight them off. Just like I did with the Serenit. That grueling campaign. Okay, I lost a man. I can't really afford to lose men. It's a bit diff- it's a bit- It's unfortunate that I lost someone, but I can do with it, I suppose. And... Just need to slice you, your head off. I, just I also need to marry someone. Maybe a vassal flock to me. I can marry his daughter or something. Where are we going? Is there just a guy down there? Is he running off? Just the peasants whacking someone. There we go. Okay. Hedge Knight was wounded, my Bravo was killed. Okay, uh, refuse, they can have it. Because what I want from you is men. Fifteen volunteers. Perfect. Meet me the elder. Okay, do you have any easy tasks? Bandits? Uh, can I get some grain? Need some grain. How much grain do you need? Six packs of grain? Fine, I'll take it. I might be able to do it. Can I recruit more soldiers? I can. Perfect. Okay, I need to recruit all the soldiers I can get. Uh, did I get any upgrades? Yes, I did. Alright, more men at arms. More veterans. I do need to keep trying to get archers, though, so I'll start going halberds. Okay, give me a power strike. And also, uh, give me iron flesh. Inventory. <laughs> oh! My power draw and fro goes down even more, but there we go. The crown, the great crown. It's, it's stronger than my actual armor. Anyway, I can give Fena that arm and sword. Finally put on this. I'm fully plated up. Oh wait, no, Fen is gone, so I can uh, give this carver, I suppose. You're happy chopping with that, right? Bonus against shields. Yeah, you can continue having your cleaver and falchion. Uh, otherwise, you're good to go. Right. Yeah, I think I think that's oh no, this is a better shield. There you go. Right, let's go recruit someone. We need more men. How many men can I have in my party? Three hundred. Okay, that's a massive improvement. Also, I spent all my money. <laughs> I have no more money. Oh, hello. There's uh some people. They ignored me. Good. Yeah, Kinstanis is here. Ah, Kinstanis! Hello. Fame runs before you. Uh, hello. I wish to become your vassal. No. I wish to ask you something. A last in the line, Snow. Okay. Can't be friends, apparently. That's fine. I want to be in Hull. Because you're going to be where I'm selling all my goods. So, take all this they got. Jerkin, Edward Helm. I'll keep the arm and sword. I'll sell this horse. And this, and this, and this. Okay, and I'll buy some cheap 
grain. In fact, I'll buy all the grain because I need to use it. I'll buy the bread. Okay, I got 3,000 coins. Good. So, I can go back to Grimsby. Or Grim... Is it... Grimsby, yeah. Elder. Hello, about the task. I've indeed brought you six packs of grain. Any more tasks? Uh, separate abandoned attack. You need lumber. Five bales of lumber. Got it. Can I recruit more men? I can. Three more levies. You're... <laughs> You're beautiful. Thank you. Uh, how about I raid a village to take their lumber? <laughs> Is that even possible? I do need four more men. How much... My, my, the majority of my men are levies, right? Yeah, 55 levies. I'm just working on them now. Let's uh, let's do a recruiting run. Let's go to Sweetport. Oh, if I... I need a mace. If I had a mace... Good. I got some dragon meat. Cool. Yeah, I'm going to abandon the bow. I'm going to try and get a mace. I need to start recruiting everyone. Can I buy a mace? Balanced Bastard Sword. Heavy Spikes Mace. That's piercing damage. You blunt. Like that. Yeah. Heavy War Mace. Yeah, okay. We're no longer of the bow. At least for now. I need I need the mace so I can start whacking some of these people and uh, taking them prisoner. Then I can even sell them. So. There was some uh, broken men, I think. Saw them. They're around here somewhere. Uh, mm, mm, yeah. Okay, I get it. I get it. No, I get it. I get it. I'll just go back to my castle, shall I? My little kingdom in the middle of the water. Okay, they're gone. Thankfully, I'm in a place where if they want to ever invade me, they have to sort of go past Stannis's land, and Stannis isn't a much of a pushover. So I've, I'm somewhat protected. Ah. I can't even see my... I can't even see my lands here! What a useless goddamn picture. Right, I need to, uh... I need to raid somewhere. Let's go to Highlock. Nope, nope. <laughs> still... Still people around. I need to take one of these men by surprise. But they're gonna... They're accompanying him. And they're going somewhere. I barely cover expenses. And that's with the castle and the, the other lands. I barely cover my expenses. In fact, I don't. I, I barely don't cover my expenses. No, that's... You're attacking me. Fine. You. Oh, no. Everyone joined. Oh, no. What's your bidding? Before you go, I have something to ask of you. We may be enemies in this war, but I pray that uh, you believe, as I do, that we can still be civil towards each other. Uh, thus, I hope that you would be kind enough to assist me in an important matter. I'm listening. I have an old friend here, an old, uh, an old warrior who is very sick. Pestilence has infected his, uh, an old battle wound. And unless he is seen by a surgeon soon, he will surely die. This man is dear to me, Cyrus Blue Exhort, uh, but he is, he is also stubborn as a hog and refuses to have anyone look at his injury because he doesn't trust the physicians here. I've heard that you have a capable surgeon with you. If you would let your surgeon come here and have a look, he may be able to convince uh, him to consent to the operation. Please, I am deeply indebted to you if you can grant me this request. You can count on me, sir. Ah, it's you again. Your surgeon man has convinced my friend. Ah! Oh! And he made the operation. Uh, the matter is now in the hands of the gods. Uh, and all we can do is pray for his recovery. Anyway, I thank you for lending me your surgeon. You have a noble spirit and I will not forget it. It was an honor to serve you, my lord. Anything else? This audience is over. 
Wow. What a nice man! <laughs> I... He just let me go. He literally just let me go. And, and now he's invading... He's raiding Land's End. There's no way I'm going to be able to attack them like this. I've got my own farmers. It's a gull town of all places. Is there any High Lords I can just fight? Uh, probably not. Enough of my party. <laughs> Uh, ah, there are some broken men, though. But that's it for this part. So, let me know what you think in the comments. <laughs> Am I doomed? I'm doomed, aren't I? I'm probably doomed. Where did all these... Hold on. The hell? Can I just check my garrison? He Hello? Where did I get all these freelancers? When did all these freelancers show up? I'm not complaining. <laughs> I just gave you some more men. Oh, wait, those are the recruited men I got. Right. Okay, that's neat. Yeah, thank God. I was, I was wondering, where did I get all these these men? But yeah, no, this is, this is good. I probably actually use the mounted people. No, keep... Pretty much, is there any levies that I actually put in here? Because I should probably take them with me. Levies aren't going to be much good in a fight, and they definitely need to be upgraded. Uh, otherwise, yeah. That's the end of this part, folks. So, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Next time, 13 volunteers. 13 men at arms. I'll build my army. 130, what was that? 137 strong. I can build that army. Although I can't support the army, so I'll definitely need to take another piece of land. Uh, maybe Sharp Point? It's quite big, though. It's like a citadel. Anywhere else, though, there's like, they've still got the armies roaming around. They own all of this, but they're focused in this area, specifically. Anyway, uh, that's it. So thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Later.